The bay is where people go swimming. The bay is where some of the most beautiful wildlife lives. The bay for me is my home away from home. The bay is where my grandchildren love to splash around on the beach. The bay is diverse. The bay is habitat. We love to swim in it, we love to sail in it, we love to fish in it. The bay is our gateway to the ocean. The bay is where I make my living. I would say for all of Houston, we need to care about Galveston Bay because it really is our greatest natural resource locally. We need to make sure that we take care of it. I grew up and spent a lot of time on the Clear, Clear Lake, Taylor Lake, in, starting in the 1960s. And back then, the water was filthy. However, over time, the water in the bay has improved dramatically. Many people enjoy the recreational aspects and other benefits of the bay, but don't realize that all water flow ultimately goes to the bay, so trash or litter or whatever can wind up in the bay, so that's important for people to recognize. The Galson Bay Foundation is a huge protector of the bay, and getting involved with that foundation was very important to me. Galveston Bay is an estuary, which means that basically it's a merging of a lot of the fresh water that's coming from our different bayous and streams throughout the greater Houston area. And it mixes with that water from the Gulf of Mexico, which means that it's an incredibly productive habitat for a variety of different species. Male or female? Female. It's incredibly important, not just as an ecosystem for fish, dolphins, crab species, but also for our local economy um, from a tourism perspective, as well as the fishing industry. It's a vital resource to the entire Houston Galveston region. Galveston Bay is the reason that we're able to live the lives that we do um, and have the quality of life that we do in Houston. It's also hugely challenged by having that gigantic metropolitan area right next to it. We have industrial and commercial uses. We have people that are recreating. It's a bay that is so important to all the residents in the greater Houston area. I grew up here around this area and in Galveston, and I've grown up around the dolphins. When I was younger, I used to see them washed ashore. So hopefully I can do what I can to make sure that these animals have a healthy environment because every day there's more and more plastics coming up on the shoreline and it's really causing an issue with the dolphins and the turtles. I volunteer with the Galveston Bay Foundation because we need to really make sure that the bay is healthy for future generations. I have two grandbabies and I want them to be able to enjoy the bay and the gulf around Galveston for a long time. I'm doing what I can to make sure that happens. The mission of the Galveston Bay Foundation is to preserve, protect, and enhance the natural resources of Galveston Bay for present users and for posterity. We want to make sure that everybody's kids and their grandkids can enjoy Galveston Bay the same way in the future as we enjoy it today. And that takes work to invest back into Galveston Bay. The Galveston Bay Foundation is the guardian of Galveston Bay, our local estuary. We not only help implement projects to restore habitat, protect water quality, engage the community, we also work with partners to do the same. We do this through a variety of program areas. One of our flagship programs is our education team. They actually work with schools both in the classroom and actually bring them to the field to educate them on environmental STEM education topics, actually getting those students hands-on experience. We also have an amazing land conservation team who preserves properties all around the base system, preventing those from further development and preserving them in perpetuity. I think there should be a sense of urgency around this. It's very easy to sort of not think about Galveston Bay and not think about all the benefits it provides us, but in reality, it's changing every day and it's not necessarily changing for the best. And so we need to make sure that we are addressing those threats today and make sure that we don't go the wrong direction on the health of Galveston Bay because it could happen very quickly. And that's why I'm super proud of the effort that we make to sort of be the watchdog of Galveston Bay and to invest back into Galveston Bay with all of our supporters supporting us along the way.